So as the day started, we were notified of a massive patch that's the landing. It arrived, most installed, and while some people benefited way more than others. As there was a time frame of about 10 minutes I believe after the patch and before the first maintenance, if you did a certain thing, you were able to purchase gear with upwards of 30k armor values. Like what? How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. So there was a glitch earlier today which like I said within a 10 minute window that if you logged into the game, went to any of the mini vendors, mainly though Bailey or Tiago I'm hearing, that they were selling armour with upwards of 25k armour stat values on it. Now I first heard about this on Facebook, uh, so a few mentions of it on Twitter and Reddit. But it slipped under the radar for most people it seems. Now I have checked and it also seems for the most part guys, even after the two maintenance episodes today, some people who purchased this armour with these crazy high values get to keep it. While others who purchased it, the armour was reverted back to those normal values. As you can see on screen now, this is footage from a friend. You can see he still has his armour. And while well, just look at it. He brought 3 or 4 armour pieces from Diego when he first logged back in this morning. And he still has this as I make this video. You can see armour here of upwards of 25k, which is utterly crazy. I mean who needs a tank build now when you have armour 3 times as strong as anyone else's. And I can also confirm that this armour does act as you would imagine. It does make you tanky. Now I will state. It does seem as though people can fly know about this bug or glitch and will no doubt sometime in the future do something about it. So if I were you guys and you landed this armour, enjoy it while you can, if that's your kind of thing. Shame I was snowing my head off when this patch drops as I was way too late to the show, but even still it's all good. But yeah guys, a quick video on the glitch if you missed it. It's crazy but I believe deep down we all know that issues with this major patch would follow. Personally for me, Playing post patch on Xbox, Xbox Series X with friends who are also on Xbox Series X's, multiplayer connectivity issues are just as bad. Constant kicks, lagging, unable to join back parties, and so much more. I will test it properly though via a stream, so if you want to catch me there, you can. But on that note, guys, the end of the video has arrived. Let me know down below in that comments section if you landed yourself some of this high value gear. Also, let me know if it's been reverted or you still have it. But on that note, the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. And hopefully, I will see you on that next one.